I always believed that the material is fundamental in the work. I was invited uh, by the curator to participate in Glass Dress, and I thought this is a great opportunity to try uh, new material. I have never tried to work with glass before because I know that uh, the technique is so difficult. And I happen to be a, a, a sculptor that likes to put the hands in the material. So for me, glass was a fascination. At the same time, a certain, I had a certain sense of uh, not being entirely with it. But it was all a thought. Glass is, is an incredible material. It's something very strange. It's very mysterious. It's very unyielding. It's, I have the impression that uh, you cannot really control it. It's all questions of seconds uh, and everything is lost. So there is a sense of impending doom all the time, you know, because well, whatever you're making in one second can be gone. You have to start all over again. And it was very emotional to me. So I made a piece that uh, I felt that this emotion was coming through the glass because there was little, I was making little chairs and the, you know, the ma maestro was making those little chairs and, and they came out uh, with the, the feet and uh, they so languid. They looked like, they looked like uh, squids. They looked like calamari. It was so beautiful, like t taken just out of the water. I made uh, many chairs in my life as an artist because the chair I feel that is really, it shows the body. A chair is used by people, by human beings. A chair is a metaphor for the human being. And a small chair is for a small human being, which is a child. So we made my first little chair and it was, I was looking at it, it was really like the soul of a child and as if the child, the soul of a child would have been fished from the, from the ocean. So I decided to make a, an installation with those chairs. And uh, since every one of them is so distorted and uh, fragile, I thought that the best way was to make a grid that was very uh, regimented, you know, in order to just even show even more that fragility. And they are all hanging on, on those iron nails that we found. They're very rustic and uh, that contrasts so much with the, with the preciousness and the beauty and ethereal quality of the, of the glass.